Hello everyone, welcome to Math Corner. In this video, we will discuss harmonic sequence. We will define, illustrate, and solve problems involving harmonic sequence. Let us begin by its definition. Harmonic sequence is a sequence such that the reciprocals of the terms form an arithmetic sequence. Example, we have 1 fourth, 1 seventh, 1 tenth, 1 thirteenth, 1 sixteenth, and so on. The reciprocal of 1 fourth is 4. The reciprocal of 1 seventh is 7. The reciprocal of 1 tenth is 10. Reciprocal of 1 thirteenth is 13. Reciprocal of 1 sixteenth is 16. And the pattern continues without end. 4, 7, 10, 13, 16, and so on is arithmetic sequence where the common difference is equal to 3. Since this is arithmetic sequence, the sequence 1 fourth, 1 seventh, 1 tenth, 1 thirteenth, 1 sixteenth, and so on is harmonic sequence. Next example, we have 3 fifths, 3 sevenths, 1 third, 3 elevenths, 3 thirteenths, and so on. Let us determine whether this sequence is harmonic sequence or not. To do that, we need to check if the reciprocals of the terms form an arithmetic sequence. The reciprocal of 3 fifths is 5 thirds. The reciprocal of 3 sevenths is 7 thirds. The reciprocal of 1 third is equal to 3. The reciprocal of 3 elevenths is 11 thirds. The reciprocal of 3 thirteenths is 13 thirds, and the pattern continues without end. Let us determine if this sequence is arithmetic sequence. 7 thirds minus 5 thirds is equal to 2 thirds. 3 minus 7 thirds, 3 is also equal to 9 thirds. 9 thirds minus 7 thirds is equal to 2 thirds. 11 thirds minus 9 thirds is equal to 2 thirds. 13 thirds minus 11 thirds, the answer is also equal to 2 thirds. There is a common difference, therefore, this sequence is arithmetic sequence. And since this is arithmetic sequence, 3 fifths, 3 sevenths, 1 third, 3 elevenths, 3 thirteenths, and so on, is harmonic sequence. Third example, we have 1 third, 1 tenth, 1 seventeenth, 1 twenty-fourth, 1 thirty-first, and so on. Let us determine the twenty-first term of this harmonic sequence. The reciprocal of 1 third is 3. Reciprocal of 1 tenth is 10. Reciprocal of 1 seventeenth is 17. Reciprocal of 1 twenty-fourth is 24. Reciprocal of 1 thirty-first is 31. And the pattern continues without end. 3, 10, 17, 24, 31, and so on is an example of arithmetic sequence where the common difference is equal to 7. Let us solve for the 21st term of this arithmetic sequence by using the formula in finding the nth term. The formula is a sub n is equal to a sub 1 plus quantity n minus 1 times d. A sub n becomes A sub 21, A sub 1 is equal to 3, n minus 1 is equal to 21 minus 1, D is equal to 7. Let us simplify, A sub 21 is equal to 3, plus 21 minus 1 is equal to 20, times 7. A sub 21 is equal to 3, plus 20 times 7 is equal to 140. 3 plus 140 is equal to 143. 143 is the 21st term of the arithmetic sequence 3, 10, 17, 24, 31, and so on. The reciprocal of 143 is 1, 143. And this is the 21st term of this harmonic sequence. Last example what is the harmonic mean between 2 and 4? In the harmonic sequence, 2 is the first term, 4 is the third term. The reciprocal of 2 is equal to 1 half. The reciprocal of 4 is equal to 1 fourth. 
the first term of the arithmetic sequence is one half, the third term is one fourth. Let us determine the second term of this arithmetic sequence. To do that, we need to solve for the common difference. To solve for the common difference, let us subtract the third term and the first term, one fourth minus one half, divided by three minus one, since one fourth is the third term and one half is the first term. One fourth minus one half is also equal to one fourth minus two fourths, divided by three minus one is equal to two. 1 fourth minus 2 fourths is equal to negative 1 fourth divided by 2. Negative 1 fourth divided by 2 is equal to negative 1 eighth. The common difference is equal to negative 1 eighth. To determine the second term of arithmetic sequence, we need to add the first term and the common difference. A sub 2 is equal to 1 half plus negative 1 eighth. 1 half is also equal to 4 eighths. 4 eighths plus negative 1 eighth or minus 1 eighth. 4 eighths minus 1 eighth is equal to 3 eighths. 3 eighths is the second term of the arithmetic sequence. The reciprocal of 3 eighths is 8 thirds. And 8 thirds is the harmonic mean between 2 and 4. Remember, if the sequence formed by the reciprocals of the terms is not arithmetic sequence, then the sequence is not harmonic sequence. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.